So a um, question on Reddit came up and uh, a little bit on the Discord. Uh, Des Soul of Chaos from Cyclic Warrior, is that impacted by spirit or intellect? Uh, seeing a lot of people uh, create builds that invest in intellect. The answer is both. Uh, intellect has a larger influence than spirit, but spirit does affect the damage. So we're going to give this a go. Um, just a heads up, I am naked, so the, the goblin is going to be scaled down to me. And you're going to see some large numbers. Um, whoops, so that was like 12,000 something, right? Let's go try it again. Let's get a bit of a, a range going on there. 12,808. And we'll try it um, maybe 12,362. So we're getting numbers like 12,362. Uh, let's do maybe two more times. 12, 7, 7, 8. And the reason I keep using the cubes is that the enemy has earth vulnerability on them afterwards. So that was 12, 5, 9, 4. And it wouldn't be too fair to test, um, like, oh, that's with the earth, that was 16,000, but that was with the earth vulnerability on. So, going over to job trees. And we're going to invest into spirit. So just kind of keep in mind that we were somewhere between mm, 12,200 and 12,800. Oops, uh, go back to this first job. So we're going to try this again. 13,689. So a, a bit of an increase from the 12,000s, but maybe it's a fluke. So we go and try again, 14,509, which is a quite a big uh, difference. Uh, 14,101, and anyone is welcome to try this test as well. 14,126, uh, 14,126, yeah, and then one more, just a. Uh, 14003. So we're going to go job settings. We're going to go reset the cyclic warrior. And this time we're going to try intellect. Um, I'm sorry, also a heads up. Sometimes the, there's, a, there's a bug with the cubes that doesn't always update when you spend your master points until you use the cubes again or if you switch jobs and switch back. So uh, this is intellect. Invested. 17,836, I think. So a, a significant increase from 12,000 or 14,000. 18,015, and then one more for good measure, 17,212. And now we're going to, uh, so we're in the 17,000 range, and I think, what did we say, 18,000 one time? Um, we're going to add a bunch of spirit, switch jobs, and then we're going to try this again. So hypothesis, we should see, what. Well, I'm sorry, let's reset this. So the hypothesis is we should significantly see more than 18,000. Not significantly, but we're, we shouldn't be in the 18,000s anymore. So 19,444. 19,508. Oops. 20,227. I know I'm butchering these numbers. And 19,896, I think. And then we're just going to do it one more time. 19,984. And so um, just kind of wanted to, to demonstrate that, uh, that aspect. 
And also while we're here, we're going to um, try the case of uh, the uh, Red Mage uh, to 50%. So it says that quick charge decreases the amount of time required to charge attacks. Um, and just kind of a heads up right now, that, that means anything that has like a charged stage, like axes, uh, or the great sword charge attack, or um, the, f the knuckles glide kick, or the focus from monk, uh, lance hurl, th those types of things, as well as magic. Uh, so magic, white magic, black magic, chain spell, um, those uh, enchant, uh, those are also affected. But what's not affected is uh, this uh, soul of chaos. So um, we're going to try this with, at, well, first, let's make sure there's no uh, affinities on that um, or uh, things that could cause, well, the Lightbringer duration is going to be the same here. So we're, we're okay here. Lightbringer 35.9%. 35.9%. So we're going to try this, All right, this is the one. naked first. Make sure we're on Earth. And we're going to try to get about 11 of these earthquakes in. So Chaos Bringer. And then I'm just spamming the button. One, two, three four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So we got about eleven of those in. Now, in order to make this video shorter, I'm not going to repeat the process five times each, but we're going to do this uh, now with a red mage. And uh, if it turns out I'm wrong, I'm wrong, and it's on video. So we're doing Chaos Bringer, and immediately doing the Earthquakes. So here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11 and uh, just that that tapping you hear that is my button pressing um, so we should have seen a significant difference for the charge time um, and I'll just demonstrate that with mage for a moment um, of what that really looks like so here's without it's one to, well, I can't count, but um, let's do this. Okay, so no MP, right? That's the amount of MP we got back. Uh, oh, shoot. You know what? Let's do that one more time. Oops, and not lunatic. What was all that earth? So this is without quick charge. Oh, darn it. <laughs> Bear with me, folks. Without quick charge. Let's see how much MP we have before the thing resets. 45 MP without quick charge. And we have 31 MP. So the, that's the difference of quick charge. Um, that, that's, that's a significant difference. And we should have seen that with Chaos Bringer and just doing the earthquakes. Uh, but I just wanted to kind of clarify a few things that might come up. And I realize this is a long video, but we'll, um, we'll revisit this. And again, anyone is welcome to test this themselves with either Chaos Shrine Goblin that's more static or this this Goblin Guard that keeps changing based on my my gear level. But yeah, um, in, 
until next time.